Good morning, everyone. It's Rhonda with Ideal Weight Loss, Ideal Body Image here in Georgetown. It is still morning. It's about 1030. A little late for breakfast, but me and another uh, client were talking about what she had for breakfast and I wanted to YouTube it because I thought it was such a great idea. We're always doing spoof, spoof spiffs on um, Starbucks things. And so I know many people love to go to Starbucks and get a chai tea latte or a chai latte tea. I don't, clearly I don't because I don't know what it's called, but thought it was such an easy thing to replicate at home. Again, feel like you're cheating, but you're really sticking on protocol. So I have this um, Bigelow vanilla chai. You actually can just use, we also have chai just tea bags, so you could totally just do tea bags and chai as well. Um, I've got my nifty Keurig here. Let's see if you can see it, along with my bottle of alcohol. And so I am going to open my Keurig, throw this in, and I'm just gonna do my largest cup, which I think is 10 or 12 ounces. And while that is brewing, I'm going to take my horchata, as some of us call it, the horacha. It's a little inside joke for my coaches. Anyway, um, the horchata, this does come in a, uh, what do you call that? A packet as well, seven in a box, or you can do a six pack. Again, always take your ring off and throw it in the trash. I give it a shake just to make sure nothing's stuck at the bottom. And then I am going to fill this up with some water. And you have a feel line on the back of these bottles, if you notice there. And that's one of the things I do love about the bottles is sometimes things are a little too sweet or not sweet enough. So you can give it more water, you can give it less water. Um, if I'm sitting at home and trying, knowing I'm gonna drink way more coffee than I should in a day. You know, I'll bring my thing up to here. And so then I can get me three cups of coffee, make sure I get all my water to adjust it. But if I'm just trying to make something fit in my thermos, you know, I'll just do it right to the line because that's I think right about eight, eight to 10 ounces. And so my, my coffee or chai tea is done. You could do this in coffee as well. Um, and so I did it in a really big mug so that I would have room to put this whole thing in. Again, if, if you want it to make two cups, do half and then the other half. But, so I'm going to pour this whole pour chata in and I'm going to give it a stir. And I now have breakfast. Or it could be a lunch if you want to do it with salad. Look at how beautiful and creamy that is. Um, I'm going to make Carrie be my taste tester today because she is a chai tea drinker. This is going to make a mess though. I know it is. I should have done it in my cup. All right, Carrie, come try this. I would drink just straight out of it, but you know, it's got the Corona. I'm dipping it here. We're going to try not to make a mess. It's a little hot, sorry. Actually, it's not too hot because you got a whole. Close your eyes, are you at Starbucks? That is very good. Okay, if any of you know Carrie, <laughs> that's saying a lot. <laughs> All right, keep on keeping on, do a great job. Let me know if you have any recommendations or suggestions. Have a great day.